All right, there you go. Hi, this is Alan, and what I want to do today is to show you how to calibrate an O2 analyzer. This is the Mini Ox 1, and it uses the galvanic fuel cells and has a Clark electrode. And uh, it actually does not require any kind of electricity or electrical current, outside electrical current, for it to read the O2 uh, in the room or in a gas source. Uh, there are two poles, and there's an electron transfer that, that occurs due to a chemical reaction with the amount of oxygen inside the room. What you need to do is that you need to make sure that your fuel cell is clean. Uh, it has to have about a one-year uh, shelf life, so you're going to want to make sure that you know, based on the serial number, when you opened it up. And then you're going to have your actual unit where you're going to be measuring or getting a digital readout of what the concentration is of the oxygen in the room. You turn it by, on by pushing the little green button, and you're going to get a readout. Um, it uses a 9-volt battery, and if you ever forget, on the back of the unit itself has the instructions on how to calibrate. Uh, what we do know is that we have two known constants. One is that we have 99.5% or 100% pure oxygen come from the wall. And we know that room air constitutes about 21% oxygen, 78% nitrogen, the other trace gases. So what we want to do is we want to take the O2 fuel cell while the unit is on and we want to place it in the bag and then we want to take our O2 source I'm just using an O2 line and I'm going to turn my gas source on and what I'm going to do is I'm going to calibrate my O2 fuel cell until it reads a hundred okay when it reads 100%, right now we're at 99. And now I'm going to tweak it down because it says 101 point. You want to take a little close up picture now? You can see that it's saying 100.1. Okay, I'm going to set it back down now. Now I'm going to take my fuel cell, my fuel cell, take it out, turn off my oxygen, not to waste it. And now what I'm looking for, as you can see, it's rapidly decreasing. And what we're wanting it to do is we're wanting it to go back down to 21%. Or very close to 21%. We're at 22.7, 0.6, 0.4, 0.5, 0.6, 0.7, 0.8, 0.9, 0.10, 0.11, 0.12, 0.13, 0.14, 0.15, 0.16, 0.17, 0.18, 0.19, 0.20, 0.21